How many know I released that word about Facebook? I said, the Lord showed me Facebook is not going to last forever. And Mark Zuckerberg is scrambling to try to keep up his kingdom over the media, which is really a, the social media, which is really a service. It's a social service. It's not a brand. Come on. Facebook. Now, Facebook ain't going to last forever. That's why you got your stuff on Facebook. Build the platform on on God, not on social media. There's no pasture there. There's no pasture. Kingdom pasture is eternal pasture. It can't be taken from you. It can't be pulled down. If Facebook shut down today, we would still have a ministry because it's built on the pasture of the kingdom. If this building crumbled to the ground, we would still have a ministry because its pasture is built on the kingdom. It's founded and it's grounded on the kingdom. Praise the Lord. So the Lord has showed me that about Facebook. And you know, Mark Zuckerberg this week, he came out with the change in the name of the business and all that and named it was Meta, Metaverse. He said, he said, so now Facebook is bigger. Now it's interesting, you know, it's funny, and I can go into a whole bunch of detail, but I'm not gonna go there. But when they started releasing the allegations about them ignoring the warning signs for the safety of the social media, come on, that's what the whistleblower was blowing the whistle about. You know, ironically, there was a shutdown. Come on, ironically, the day after the whistleblower said, oh, Facebook had all, something went wrong. The years of the, you know, so we know the scrambling to try to fix some things. Now, this is important for us to pay attention to social media. Obviously, watch these things. Watch some of the trends that are happening in the media world because the shifts are taking place. And God is answering. Somebody say, God is answering. He's shifting and he's putting some things in position. I mean, you know, Facebook was one of the media platforms that was leading a lot of the corruption. It was part of, it was investing into the corruption that took place. Come on, Holy Spirit's got me all the way out there. A lot of the corruption that took place last year was working with some of those world leaders that the, 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 they don't like us using the word cabal, but that cabal, those world leaders that are up there in high places that are moved by money. Come on, America, we need to wake up. God said we're going to begin to speak to a Joseph generation. And get me in those uncomfortable places. Those guys in high places, come on, they're pulling the strings. That's why you got to hear the spirit for your house. Pay attention to what God is saying to you. The Holy Spirit will reveal to you. So it's coming back around. The Lord said to us last year, I will always answer. I will always have the final say. No matter what it looks like in your situation, no matter what it looks like, I will always have the final say. That's what God said. And if you can stand long enough, you will see his answer. If you can stand long enough, you'll see his answer. You'll be a witness of his answer. Oh, he's going to answer whether you see it or not. But I want to see it, so I'm going to stand. I want to be a witness of it. There's a timing and there's a season for his answer. Praise the Lord. So he came up with a meta, so the new business name, meta, meta verse. Everybody's trying to build a kingdom, those towers. How many know that the American dream is really the spirit behind it is the tower, is that same spirit behind the tower of Babel. It's Babel, Babylon. Come on. It's the spirit of Babylon, which is the spirit of the world. Everybody's trying to build their own tower. Facebook comes out and says, uh, we're not going to change our name to Meta, meaning Metaverse, meaning that we're trying to create a world within our 
Come on. So he's saying we're more than just social media anymore. Come on, they're flying. Building. Come on. And when you're in the world, that's the natural process. You always revert back to building the tower above God. Well, what's the tower trying to do? It's trying to, the Bible says, the tower of Babel. He said that they had in mind to build a tower into heaven. Now, it wasn't talking about them literally building a tower from the earth into the clouds. But we misinterpret the scripture sometimes because we misunderstand the spirit of it. How many know people back then, they understood some spiritual things? They were trying to build a prayer altar. They were trying to build a tower into heaven. In other words, they were trying to break it into the spirit the bible talks about uh nimrod and he was a mighty warrior and the bible says that he was a mighty hunter and uh he was one of the founding fathers of the cities the first cities in that time and they were collecting a people, but they weren't just collecting any type of people. They were collecting a people, a spiritual people, to break into the spirit, to build a tower. Come on. Behind the faces of those leaders, those places. Come on, it was the enemy kingdom. Always trying to rebuild his kingdom above the kingdom of God. Come on. So man can't operate outside of himself. Either you're for God or you're for the other kingdom. Praise the Lord. So you got to pay attention. So they were building a tower. We see it happening today. It's a cycle. It continues. It repeats. And every organization that is not submitted to God. Every organization that you see that is enlarging, that has an influence, eventually it begins to build that tower. When I saw the Facebook news there, I said, well, look at that. He's beginning to try to build his kingdom. We saw Microsoft try to do the same thing. Come on. So he's building the metaverse. It's talking about virtual reality rooms. Now, it's, it's going to be, it's going to be, um, helpful in our society for connecting socially for business this is the process that we are on and then god is has his uh hands in the, those arenas uh breakout centers on facebook come on on youtube but we are not the media we're going into the media somebody say i'm not of the world but i'm in the world okay so whatever man tries to build god was looking for people to send in to be the alternative to counteract to my piercing the darkness pushing back on the enemy come on but that creative realm is accessed there in the poetry and the arts in the media. Praise the Lord. So